Hello friends, today you'll see how actors of the movie X-Men have changed. You'll know their original names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 2000 and what's with them now in 2021. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, let's go! Wolverine, played by Hugh Jackman, also known as Logan, was a mutant born with retractable forearm clothes, enhanced physical parameters and a powerful healing factor. The co-leader of the X-Men, he was also a famous hero and warrior being a veteran of multiple wars. Eric Lancher, also known as Magneto, Ian McKellen, is an extremely powerful mutant with the ability to manipulate magnetic fields to his will and control metallic objects. He was a founding member of the X-Men, but led the group to form the Brotherhood of Mutants. Sabretooth, Tyler Maine, is a mutant who has a number of animal-like abilities such as retractable clothes, enhanced senses and a regenerative healing factor. Magneto sends Sabretooth to hunt down and capture Rogue. He eventually locates her traveling with Wolverine. Cyclops, born Scott Summers, is a mutant with the ability to fire an optic blast from his eyes. Having been one of the first members of the modern group of X-Men, Scott Summers was chosen to succeed his mentor and become the X-Men's field leader. Rogue, Anna Paquin, whose real name is Mary Dencanta, was an innocent young girl from a peaceful neighborhood in Meridian, also a mutant who absorbs the powers or memories of any person touching her skin. If the contact continues for too long, it may kill the other person. Professor Charles Xavier, Patrick Stewart, is a mutant, an immensely powerful telepath and scientific genius. Charles was mainly known as the heart and soul of the X-Men. His dreams of a peaceful coexistence between mutants and humanity has been the driving force for the X-Men. Jean Grey, played by Famke Janssen, is an extremely powerful mutant whose abilities varied across her appearances. He has the ability to move objects with her mind, ranging from doors to people, cars. Jean can fly using her telekinesis by projecting herself through the air. Toad was a mutant who had the ability to leap far distances, split slime and had a strong and flexible long tongue. Toad proved he can walk on walls due to a substance that is secreted from his skin and his acid can cause paralysis as well. He was played by Ray Park. Aurora Mandro or Storm Halle Berry, is a powerful mutant who is able to control the weather. She can control tempests such as lightning, thunderstorms, hurricanes, blizzards, tornadoes, mist and typhoons. She is even able to fly by making the wind lift her up in the air. Robert Kelly, Bruce Davison, was a United States Senator who advocated for the implementation of the Mutant Registration Act. He was captured by a mystic and was turned into a mutant by a machine operated by Magneto, but subsequently died from his unstable mutation. George Bozza is an actor who played Beast and his alternate universe counterpart on X-Men and Spider-Man was given a cameo as a truck driver in the first X-Men film. When the movie producers found out he was the voice of Beast, they became excited about including him. Henry Geirich is one of the few people who were aware of Project Wide Awake and represents Senator Kelly's political party by supporting the Mutant Registration Act with former military scientist Dr. Trask. Geirich was killed by Sabretooth. He was played by Matthew Sharp. Being in Auschwitz, young Magneto shows his strength for the first time. Nazis lead prisoners, father, mother and young Magneto. Then they separate adults and children. The boy Magneto begins to cry and with his strength bends a large metal gate and the Nazis cannot hold him. Stu, Kevin Rushton, willing to fight an undefeated champion in the cage match. After the fight, Stu wanted his money. He got a knife and went to stab Logan from behind. Rogue, who was sitting nearby, screamed and Wolverine got out of the way and pulled his claws to his neck. Bobby Drake, or Iceman, 
Sean Ashmore, is a mutant who can freeze anything around him and turn his body into ice. He lived with his mother and father. Eventually, he began to display mutant abilities, but he kept it from them out of fear. He went to Xavier's school. Tommy, played by Matt Weinberg, is a human child who saw Senator Kelly come out of the beach. Tom was poking at the jellyfish. His sister was telling him to stop. He saw Senator Kelly come out of the water naked. He was in shock, like the many others on the beach. Museum Cop is a minor character in the film. He appears only once when, having arrived at the call to the museum, he discovers Mystic, which, having turned into a policeman, lies on the floor wounded in the stomach by Wolverine. Museum Cop was portrayed by actor David Hayter. Stan Lee was one of the creators of many Marvel's comic book superheroes such as the X-Men, Spider-Man, the Avengers and many others. Stan Lee has played a small role in the film X-Men. He is a hot dog vendor seen when the senator emerged from the water after escaping Magneto. Daniel Ryan Madger is a Canadian actor. He has appeared in many projects such as the famous Jet Jackson and the X-Men. His most prolific role is Edwin Venturi on Life with Derek. In the X-Men film, he played a minor character named Boyan Ruff and appeared for a short time. Aaron Tiger was an actor, poet, artist and sculptor. He appeared in a variety of theatrical, television and film productions and has had parts in the movie X-Men, Rocky Marciano, Holiday Romance. In the X-Men, he briefly plays MC when Wolverine fights too. Sean Roberts is an actor best known for his roles in zombie films such as The Land of the Dead, Diary of the Dead and the Resident Evil franchise. His film debut was in the television series Emily. He became famous in X-Men, where he played a small role of Rogue's boyfriend. Mystic Rebecca Romaine is a ruthless and evil woman who would kill without a second thought. She is a mutant with the ability to shape-shift into anyone. Mystic can alter the formation of her cells at will, allowing her to look and sound like an exact duplicate of any being. Kitty Pride, also known as Shadow Cat, Samela K, is a mutant with the ability to phase through matter and project a person's consciousness back in time. Kitty was a student at Xavier's school for gifted youngsters. Kitty also took history classes taught by Storm. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course, subscribe to the channel.